Hello friends. Have you ever wondered what could be faster than a tank but still protected enough to withstand an enemy's attack? Today we'll talk about the Type 16 MCV, a unique wheeled armored vehicle from Japan, combining speed, maneuverability, and powerful weaponry. Stay with us to find out why this machine is crucial for Japan's defense and how it might change the course of battles. In the 2000s, Japan's military realized that their old armored personnel carriers and vehicles were no longer effective against modern threats. Japan is an island nation, facing various natural conditions and security threats from other countries. To address this issue, Japan began searching for new, more mobile and powerful machines. This is when the Type 16 MCV project was born. The main goal of its development was to create an armored vehicle combining high speed, maneuverability and protection against modern threats while still being light enough to move across different terrains quickly. The development of the Type 16 began with the decision to use a wheeled chassis. This was important because wheeled vehicles are faster and more maneuverable than traditional tracked ones. Additionally, they consume less fuel and are easier to maintain. On the battlefield, high mobility is a decisive factor. The faster a machine moves, the harder it is for the enemy to hit it. Unlike heavy tanks, which move slowly, the Type 16 MCV can reach speeds of up to 100 km per hour, making it one of the fastest combat vehicles. Another key aspect was the choice of weaponry. Japan, like any other country, must defend itself against various threats, from infantry and light vehicles to tanks. And here the developers didn't go wrong. The Type 16 is equipped with a 105mm cannon capable of piercing the armor of enemy vehicles and destroying heavy equipment such as tanks. To protect against infantry and light targets, the vehicle is armed with a 7.62mm machine gun. This weaponry makes the Type 16 a versatile machine. It can take out enemy tanks and provide protection for its own soldiers. But it's not just about speed and firepower. The Type 16 MCV also offers solid protection. Of course, its armor is not as heavy as a tank's, but it is strong enough to withstand small arms fire and medium caliber projectiles. It also provides protection against shrapnel and explosive devices. Imagine this. The vehicle can withstand hits from shells and keep moving, giving it a significant advantage on the battlefield. The compact size of this vehicle also plays a major role. Unlike massive tanks that can struggle to navigate narrow city streets or mountain paths, the Type 16 with a length of only 7.5 meters and a width of 2.6 meters, can easily maneuver in such environments. Picture yourself in a densely populated city with narrow streets, and enemy vehicles appear on the horizon. What's important here is that the Type 16 can quickly move, take up the best positions, and maneuver around obstacles and cover. This maneuverability makes it ideal for urban and mountainous operations. Furthermore, the Type 16 is equipped with modern targeting and fire control systems. This means that its cannon can accurately target even in poor visibility. Even if the enemy is hiding behind cover, the Type 16 can hit them from a long distance, making it effective in a variety of combat situations. And since the cannon is remotely controlled, the crew can remain in a safe location without being exposed to danger. Interestingly, apart from combat operations, the Type 16 MCV can also be used for peacekeeping missions. For example, to restore order in conflict zones or in areas where the safety of civilians needs to be ensured. The high mobility and compact size make it perfect for patrolling and maintaining control over urban and mountainous regions. The Type 16 easily fits into various scenarios, whether it's active combat or more peacekeeping operations. The Type 16 was officially adopted by Japan's Self-Defense Forces in 2014, and since then, it has been actively used. Today, several hundred of these vehicles are in service. It's important to note that the Type 16 participates in exercises and drills, testing its capabilities in real combat conditions. Every year, these vehicles become a more integral part of Japan's defense, and their effectiveness continues to grow. Impressive characteristics of the Type 16 go beyond its combat abilities. This vehicle also has good logistics and transportation capabilities. For example, it can operate in a variety of climates, such as intense heat or cold, making it versatile for different theaters of operations. This also adds value because any military conflict can unfold in various regions with different natural conditions. However, despite all its advantages, the Type 16 is not without its weaknesses. For example, its armor cannot protect it from powerful tank shells or large caliber cannons. But this doesn't make it useless, it's simply designed for different types of tasks. For example, for deterring the enemy or supporting infantry, rather than directly engaging with heavy tanks. 
this is a well thought out balance between mobility and firepower. Additionally, using the Type 16 helps significantly reduce the costs of maintenance and operation compared to tanks. Wheeled vehicles are easier and cheaper to maintain than tracked ones, allowing the military to allocate resources more effectively. After all, high mobility and battlefield availability are more important than ever, and the Type 16 excels in this regard. In the future, the Type 16 MCV may be further improved. For example, enhancements to its armor protection, the integration of new technologies to improve targeting accuracy, or greater automation. The development of such technologies is actively underway in Japan, and the Type 16 could be just the beginning of a new generation of wheeled armored vehicles. In conclusion, the Type 16 MCV is one of the most interesting and promising military vehicles in the world today. Combining high mobility, powerful firepower, and solid protection, it is an effective tool for various military operations. In the future, such machines may play an even more significant role in the defense strategies of countries. But for Japan, the Type 16 is already an indispensable part of its military, helping to ensure the country's security and defense. If you enjoyed our story, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, like the video, and leave a comment. We're always happy to discuss the most interesting topics and share new facts with you.